Hello, hello, hello. Making a video with my papa dog. And I want to tell something very beautiful. My papa dog was there for me today. 100%. I cried this morning. Cried real, real, real pitifully in the living room. It was so intense that I cried like... I cried like like a child or a wolf. It was so intense. And my papa dog, he cried with me the same way. That's how much compassion dogs have. They feel you. When I feel sad and I cry, my papa dog cries with me. That's very, very touching, is that? I woke up was in this coldness, cold room. Everything was cold. The bathroom's 30 degrees. It gets real cold in the winter time. And my husband doesn't like to leave the heaters on during the night. And then everything gets really, really cold. And then when we get up, we have to turn a whole lot of heaters on, waste a whole lot of electricity. <laughs> waste way more electricity than if we left one heater on that kept everything in a stable temperature. One time he went to the other house alone, that was like, I don't know, it was in 2011, I think. He went, to, I was with Kenny, our former dog. He went to the other house for, he had to do something there for two or three days. And as soon as he left, I turned two heaters on and then after it got warmer I turned one off and I left one on all night long every day and the temperature balanced out and I only had one heater on but he for some reason he can't stand it if there's a heater on at night it's like a phobia or something it could go it could spark a fire or some bullshit like that or he gets overheated if it gets up to 50 degrees, it might get overheated. So it's better to have it 30 degrees then. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it doesn't make any sense and makes me very angry. I had a lot of anger again this morning. Didn't know how to deal with that anger. I'm not letting the anger out on, on anything. So I'm not bottling it up, but... I, the only way to deal with it is the path within oneself, and that means, that means we can howl and cry, we can howl and cry. And we can pray to our personal God or guardian angel or spirit guide or whatever, whoever, whomever you talk to or if it's just the wall or the room or the sky, we can pray and that's what I did. And when we do that, then we really, that is the journey within, totally. Because then we're no longer wanting something from someone else. We're no longer trying to correct someone else. Prayer, real prayer, is a total inwardness process. Is the journey within, yeah prayer to the infinite cosmos we can talk to the infinite we can 
say anything we want. We can also shout and get mad and we can say anything we want to say. The infinite cosmos has infinite patience. And the infinite cosmos always say, says to us, everything is good. I saw the blue god in cloud formation again today. In Kenny form, our former dog. Kenny was the manifestation of the blue god. And the cloud formation showed him. He was turned on his back with these huge feet. And, and the message to me was, everything is good. Everything is good. Don't worry. Everything is good. You're going through it. We're going through this together. That is the message. And it's good to express the feelings honestly and directly and not just do an escape route or try to speak in riddles or something, but say directly what, what we want. And feel sorry for ourselves. It's okay. And cry deeply deeply for that because that's where it goes and that's that's what it is and the anger to let the anger out in form of deep 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 howls rhythmic howls and then go deeper into it and there is the inner child and and there is the baby and there is that being that we are and have been that is totally innocent and helpless and feel it and, and flow through and let it cry itself out and the Papa dog cried with me together in, in rhythmic howls that is the most amazing thing because he has so infinite compassion. Dogs are gods. Okay. So my message to the world is keep everything warm in the house and keep your animals in the house with you. They deserve warmth because warmth is love. Okay. You guys take care. Bye-bye.